go, because we have an empty spot, we could go island hop and try to get a new villager. Because I kind of want a, an RNG one. The amiibo cards are fun, but you know what you're getting. And it's kind of fun to go do find someone random. All right, so let's go try, let's go try to find a villager. Wait, should I go buy more tickets or is three okay? Or where do I even, I buy them for the Nook Miles thing, right? Yeah, we can just do three for now. I mean, we could get lucky, but three tickets gonna get you like a Beardo? Okay, I don't know who that is, but it doesn't sound good. I don't want, I don't want that. I'll get five. If we need more, we'll need more, but. These are kind of rough on the, on the wallet, aren't they? All right, so we have a one in five chance to get someone decent, maybe. Hard time is you don't know who you're gonna get next, right? Unless we're like looking for a specific villager, you don't know who you're gonna get. So you might find someone decent. You're like, oh, this is pretty good. And then if you just waited, you might find someone even better. Uh, Personality-wise, I don't really know. I, I don't really like the motherly or sweet types. I think I kind of like the sassy, peppy ones. They're kind of fun. It's been a while since we've been here. Let's do it. Okay, let's go fly. We are ready. We got everything. Wait, there's something big back there. It's a bald eagle. the same voice but it's scary and deep wasn't expecting to run into well much of anyone out here whoever it is exactly solid villager wait chat is this really <laughs> why is he still, like he's talking through a speaker box wasn't expecting a meet and greet on this tour but then again i ain't sure what i expected to find here damn people run like twenty thousand trips to find him wait is this someone good Chat? Oh my gosh, are, are, just like that? Are we doing it? Chat says he's great. I actually kind of want the weeds. Well, why do we even need five tickets if we find it on the first try? Yeah, go for it? Okay, well, Paul's trying to jump in the water. So we don't want that. I like his design. Personally, don't like him. I mean, he seems kind of cool. Very stoic. Well, let's just do it at least. We can always kick someone else off. <laughs> it, it's okay. <laughs> I'll lie. It's a great island. Uh, I'm trying to kick someone else out eventually. Yeah, nonsense. Paperwork. Guess we'll be calling that place home much longer, will I? <laughs> well, there we go, chat. Oh, he's an old villager from long in the quality design, I see. Okay. He's still a fan favorite because he's cranky and alright, cool. Well, you know what? That was pretty simple. Why do we get all these five tickets? Oh, he's up there. What am I doing? I actually need to pick up weeds because hedges require weeds. So it'd be nice. I also I could also bring flowers, but that's not really as important. Hey Jackknife, how you doing? My hype for worlds? I am actually. Do you know when that starts, by the way? I haven't even paid enough attention. Honestly, though, he seems... I did not mean to grab that. I hate grabbing the flower tops. 
He seems he seems cool. And he's probably going to be better than a lot of our villagers, which, by the way, we're going to definitely kick out some more anyways. So it's it's fine having these other tickets. Because he'll move in. Toby will kick someone else out. Is the plan. And we probably have like three or four villagers. I, I would be totally fine to get rid of. Dude, how did that miss? I know I'm too close to it, but whatever. Is this another fossil right here? I've been to a regular kick hands Hans and Ozzy. So Ozzy's going, Shep is going. I'm just saying this off. I mean, we haven't made any real plans. Shep, I've like literally not talked to Shep ever. He's so kind of boring. October 5th, okay, cool. Um, Ozzy was fine, he's been kind of cute. But then he recently sent us a very threatening letter in the mail, which uh, I didn't like. So now I'm a little scared of him. Like he was fine up till that letter and like, now I'm stressing. You're gonna head off for the bed? Hey, have a great night. Thanks for the $5 earlier, Flame Dice. You have a good one, mate. Appreciate you being here. Yeah, he sent a threatening letter. Telling me he had like, licked some food and then dipped a letter in the food and then licked the letter. Like actual warning signs. No, you know what? Agnes is staying. I like Agnes. I like her personality. Initially, you know, we we're like, eh, whatever on Agnes, but no, Agne Agnes is. I like Agnes. I like Rowan too. Oh, I forgot. Whatever. <laughs> forgot I had eaten fruit. <laughs> My bad. <laughs> whatever. It's this island's problem. Agnes, I, I, I like. Rowan, I like. Um. Who else do I like? All right, so this island was a good find. Oh, Apple's great. Apple's great. No, no, Apple, Apple's been a really good find. Well, that was all the weeds on the island. Or pretty much. I'm not sure how many more hedges or not I will build anyways, but just have the option. Now... If I dive here, is there a potential to find some other sea creatures than what I find normally? You like Marcy? I'm not huge on Marcy. I think she's kind of boring. Like, can I find... I don't think so. Okay. All right, I'm actually. I think we're good here, then, chat. Right? We got our we got our villager first try. Apparently, a pretty rare, good one that people really like. Should be all the DIY on the beach somewhere. Oh, don't you also shake trees? You can get a DIY recipe. Let me look for that DIY recipe. As well as one wasp nest. Furniture and bees are in the tree. Okay. So I need to have my net out. I don't see the DIY recipe. It's never guaranteed. Oh, it looks like we got unlucky. Hmm. 
Does it fall at first time or does it take a couple of shakes? Oh! Get back in there, buddy. <laughs> yeah, I was ready for you. No DIY recipes yet. You think it's one of these ones up here, chat? I'm gonna gamble and not have my net out. I'm literally just being a menace to this island and not doing anything. Like, I'm just shaking all their trees. I could pick up the sticks, actually. That wouldn't be bad. I mean, I honestly could pick up everything and sell it. Apollo thinks I'm a crazy person. Oh, we are not getting lucky. There it is, the last one. Literally the last one on the island. Amazing, unfinished puzzle? Wait, what the? Wait, that's not a DIY recipe? Why is there an unfinished puzzle in this tree? What is that? That was the, my furniture item? Unfinished puzzle? Who threw that there? They got so pissed off they just threw it in a tree. Wow. We're uh We're a little unlucky, aren't we, chat? Clearly Apollo hates puzzles. Yeah, dude, dude got pissed and just threw it up that in there. To be fair, if he came all his way to do his puzzle and then was missing a piece, I'd be pretty mad too. Maybe if I shake other trees I can find the puzzle piece. That sounds actually kind of valid. This island's got some nice beachy vibes to it, or music to it, but uh, it doesn't feel that beachy. I think I already have you, but I'm gonna get you again. Yeah, it's just a stink bug. I need to catch five bugs anyways to get those nook miles. I haven't been really trying that hard, but... A lot of little fish in the water, too. I have not gone fishing in... Forever. Wow. Excellent. Uh, I think we're done here, Chad. I don't think there's anything else we need to do. We kind of picked up everything we wanted. I mean, we could, I, this is the fish. This is a rare fish right here. No one's ever caught it before. Apparently he's not interested. Look at it. Calling it sea bass? Yeah, it's probably sea bass. I'm not a sea bass. It's a big flounder. Yeah, I think we've got everything we need, though. All right. I think we're out of here. They don't sell for much? Dang it. Bell Bottom Techno. This is Stovetop Toothbrush? What are these code names? How'd you get Stovetop Toothbrush? Do you cook with that toothbrush? Trash fish, okay. 
We're leaving Apollo behind. He, but he can fly. Hey! I would call that successful. We literally flew and found a random rare villager. Or at least a sought after villager. I don't know if he's rare or not, but. Yeah, Apple's been good. Apple's a good villager. Yeah, it was Anka would be cool. I do know Anka. I know Anka and then that other really trendy looking cat. I forgot the name though. Wait, what am I doing in here? Do I need to talk to him about anything? I thought there was another cat or something that was everyone like liked. No, I guess we're good here actually. A cat would be cool. Anka, I mean, obviously Anka would be cool, but I'm not really gonna go grinding out to try to get uh, any of the popular ones. We're just kind of going with whatever shows up. Should be sold now, right? Yeah, Apollo, moving in. That was kind of fun, chat. But now we have to wait for... Uh, to invite Toby to kick one of our other villagers out. Oh, Bob's kind of cool, isn't he? I am back. You can have this, 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 those, those. I'd maybe put this by the campsite would be the only thing. Five thousand? What a rip off. No one dislikes Bob. So I've heard. I've heard Bob's pretty sweet. That can go in our home. Let's just drop that off. Well, I'm happy about that chat. We've, we've actually got our whole village quota filled. And then we can invite Toby hopefully tomorrow. And, uh... And kick someone else off for Toby. Every time I see the road to your house, it die a little on the inside. Rainbow, what's wrong with my road to my house? I had to do two, and then you can only build one. And there's a little pathway here to my pipe. But what's or, or, or are you dying to this road? This road's a little whack. I agree with you 100%. This road's pretty whack right here. No, I agree. This is actually painful, chat. I don't like this either. So maybe what I have to do is I have to change it to two and then just build it into a one like I do for everyone else's house. I don't know. Or this row. This row is pretty painful. I mean, I guess I could go this way and then curl over. Like, come straight and then curl down this way. That would work fine, too. And then this area right here, maybe I put another stall. You know what? I'm fine with that. You've convinced me. We also try fixing up there. If I offset the stairs. What do you mean offset? I'm like moving somewhere else. 
I mean, I could definitely move this stuff too, but I have not because it's kind of a pain and expensive and I haven't wanted to do that. Well, we'll fix this little part up first. Chat's complaining, but for good reason, so. This will probably look more natural. Or at least better. Like shift the pathway to the right? Or the stairs to the right? But shifting to the right, what does it do for me? The public benches were always relevant. Okay, so now I'll build like a stall here and that would look nice. Or another, yeah, probably just a stall. I mean, so the pathway could come, like... No! Can I not do it with construction tool out? Dude, no! What? That's so terrible. All right. Here, maybe if we... I, I hate that I hear these now. This is terrible. Maybe make it more like a landing. No, oh, God, stop it. I hear it. No. God, that was like six of them in a row. No, what I could do is I can make a I can make the path go over here towards my waterfall area. And then it won't look so bad. Oh, I know they come in bunches, but that was painful. God, this looks like crap. Ah, oh, Animal Crossings, why? I mean, this would look less crap if I just make a single pathway. But the problem is that looks kind of whack too, doesn't it? I guess it's better, honestly. so painful okay so if I do my waterfall idea this our romantic spot might have to move I mean no shut up I know it's not better um oh no I hate this angle. I'm going to totally whiff. Oh, God. I can't even see it. Ah! Oh, he got stuck on the tree. Oh, God. He got stuck on the tree. Oh, that was terrifying. Ah! No! Press ZL in accident. What? Why did he? S Do they actually sprint and chase you down like that? What's his problem? I'm scared of my island, dude. That's why we need Apollo here. Eat the bird. Eat the bugs. 
So what I was gonna do over here is, like I said, build a staircase right here. The one that's over here is gonna probably be removed. And then we'll build our staircase Honestly, probably in about the same spot. We just need to make a vertical. We need, we need to increase the vertical land space here. I'm still really sad about dying to that tarantula, actually. That's, I'm just trying to build our line. It should be right there. Yeah, that's that's the line we want. I will probably have to move. I'm not really sure how far I want to move this down. Hmm. So for these uh, unaware, this is going to be a little bit of river here. And I'm going to build a bridge right over top. River's gonna come back over here. And then I thought about putting um, a waterfall right here. Either, like, I don't really want the river coming off of this because I think that looks a little unnatural, but it technically could. It could come here and split. Maybe I make the waterfall a little bit bigger and it splits and comes down this way. Or the waterfall, or I make this, like, path, this cliff all the way over to here and the waterfall falls down over here. And then it leads to a river, which comes across here, falls down here as a waterfall. And then we have a nice little, either a pond right here, or it connects to the river. I'm not sure yet. If it connects to the river, then we have to build another bridge. But well, it could just be a pond. And then I was thinking about a little bit of a land bridge with our pathway. And then into the stairs, maybe right around here. Another option is I remove, I fill this end here. I, the problem I'm having right now is what to do with this back area. So you see, we've got these cliffs up there in the back, which I don't mind. I like, I like the cliffs, but they're not doing anything. And I'm not sure what to do with them. I could build a river back there instead too. Could also add more cliffs over there too if I wanted. But this area is all kind of wasted, you know what I mean? Over there's the gonna probably be our lake, I think. If I build the lake, then maybe I block this river up and make the river come from the other way. I think that's probably what I'll end up doing. There's a treasure. or not oh it's just really far away okay nice good treasure straight ten thousand dollars I'm not sure exactly where we're going to put this, so for now, I'm not going to go crazy. But this will help establish the idea. Like that. There we go. So we at least have like an established idea now of, of what we 
potentially could have there. I'm thinking about filling this in and making a lake out of that and then having a waterfall in the back area instead, which I think would look really nice instead of the horizontal waterfall. In fact, should we just try and do that, chat? I think maybe we just do that. Let's see what it looks like. So I would fill all of this in. And make this into a big lake. And then have back here be a waterfall. Maybe a giant waterfall. Literally like all of that be waterfall. Into our big lake. I can also move this campsite a little bit closer over here, maybe on this side, and then make the lake around. <laughs> yeah, I think that'd look pretty nice. I won't be doing all this though. In fact, I think we'll actually probably call it quits pretty soon. Uh, this is something that I will think about a little bit more. Or how we want to do it per se. Looks kind of like a secret underground pathway though with water. It's kind of funny. Actually, wasn't intentional, but it's kind of cool. But what do you all think of that? And I'll, actually, my other question for you all is, can water drop from double height? Like, if I have water up there on that that upper area, can it drop all the way down to my lower area? Or does it have to go down and then down again? Because you can make a pretty crazy waterfall if I go up high. It has to go down and down again? Okay, that's a bit of a bummer. I guess Cascades wouldn't be too bad. But what do you all think? So the only, my only concern is that maybe the river to it would look a little bit weird. Well, let's say we had water up on that upper area and I extended that upper area all the way over here. And instead of my water dropping down right there, it stayed on this upper area. So upper area, upper area, water, water, water. And then right here is a giant waterfall from upper there to down to down again into a big lake. And then that lake surrounds my campsite. This upper area then has the lake right there. And this is probably filled in or more water. I'm not really sure if we want a double river or not. Or fills there and then it comes over here and fills down this way would probably be my thought process. Okay. Yeah, I'm gonna leave that for now. And like I said, this one might be a waterfall coming down here at some point. I'm gonna have to probably dam up this water to figure out exactly how I wanna make it work. And then figure out the lake idea. But I'm not gonna do that all today. In fact, I think we're gonna call it call it quits right here. We're at a pretty good stopping point where we got a decent amount accomplished. I don't know if there's anything else I need to to do on that. I'm excited for our new villager. We can come back and work with uh, Toby at some point. And hopefully get him invited. Our garden over here is looking pretty good. So we're 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 moving along. I mean, it's kind of it's it's getting there. I think it's actually getting pretty nice. I don't know how crazy I'm gonna go on on everything else in this game, but I have like a little bit of a vision, and I kind of want to see that vision through. And once the island feels pretty pretty good, I'll I'll feel pretty accomplished, if that makes sense. 
I think it's come a long way. I was watching, like I said, the recent YouTube videos, and it's come such a far ways from when we initially started playing the game. What are lasers? I'm really hoping you'll take my baby romper off my hands. Apple, did you have a baby without me knowing? I don't need this baby romper. Why would, why am I giving people baby rompers? What? What does that have to do with lasers? What is she talking about? Is she crazy? What? Agnes? I mean, Agnes. Apple? Are you okay? All right. Well, our clearly our villagers are a little little tweaked in the head. I don't have a pacifier. I have bubble gum in my mouth. Uh, and then obviously over here, I don't mind having no hedges like to their houses. I actually think it looks pretty nice, but we can build more hedges. The trees I think should come down and be maybe more uniform in this area would look really nice. The flowers are looking pretty good. I can obviously get more and dig up more and move them over here. These are looking nice. This part of the island, I have no idea what to do with. I might just honestly plant it like a tree orchard and leave it. Like, I might just build them in lines and call it good. I, I don't really know what to do. The same with the beaches. I don't. I have no idea. We got a couple of wasted spaces that I think I'm just going to probably plant trees and call it done. <laughs> I'm not sure. <laughs> we might redo this and build a bridge right here instead. Across just to get access to our pumpkins a little bit better. And then make this into a bigger lake area. We can still leave this bridge over to the lake. I mean, across the lake. Or we could do multiple bridges, which might be pretty cool. Yeah, it's not the perfect gift. I have no idea what Agnes or Apple's talking about. Crazy. I have not really looked at my beaches at all. I mean, I know you can do some more cool things with them design-wise. I've been to some people's uh, islands that have really... Crazy cool designs. I just, I don't know if I'm going to go that crazy. I think I'm going to get my village in a pretty happy spot. I think it's honestly looking amazing. But I could see a future where I kind of keep hedging things off and maybe add more flowers and tree line things a little bit more. Hey, Maiden, how you doing? She just surplus of baby rompers? I don't know what Apple's doing. Your beaches are adorned with sur surplus fish. I think this turned out really nicely. Maybe this one section over here, I could curve it in a little bit more. I don't know. It's. I think this turned out nicely though, like a little tiny pond coming off of the uh, off of our Zen Garden area. Might be another big pond right here, or like I said, maybe it'll connect over to the river. It might. It, it might just end up connecting. Honestly, the house is one of the least of my concerns. I want to look better than what it looks like currently, but I don't really care about it that much. So I'm not gonna go ever really crazy here. Really just the island matters way more to me than the house. But I think that is gonna be the end of our Animal Crossing for tonight. GG!